Hello everybody, welcome back to Shin Megami Tensei episode 12. So last episode we took care of two side quests by Paper Man over there and Whiny Oni on the, uh, in the mountains over there. So now we're going to continue on with the main story. So we're at the diet building. Listen well. Okay. Guess we have Hallelujah. to do this. Hallelujah. So wait, what do we have to do? Oh yeah, yeah, we have to go over here. Okay. Uh, how far do I have to go? Oh, so I have to go all the way around in the mountains again. Great. I think I'm just gonna do a cut there real quick just to speed things up. So see you guys there. All right, we are back. Be careful. Oh, another boss. Let's do it. Oh. So Andros and Barrett, I don't remember their weaknesses. Uh so I know Andros does force, so he's probably weak to electric. But, oh, I think Eligor, not Barret, uh, Eligor might be weak to electric as well. He is, okay, cool. Uh, let's see if these guys are also weak. Yep, cool. Just makes my life a little bit easier. We're just gonna use this as a defense down. And then fire. I'm not sure about anybody's fire weaknesses, so we're just gonna attack with this. We could take him out turn one. That'd be great. He's not even a threat if that's the case. So we really just got lucky with the type resistance. Because I had no idea that this man was going to be a boss. Um, yeah. Do some damage to you. Oh, you blocked that. Well, there goes our turns. Oh, Jack Frost is weak to that. Kukaja, that's fine. We're good. Finish you off. All right, big baddie is down for the count. <laughs> All right, so we can't use ice. What about this? Oh, that's interesting. So if you actually hit all the weaknesses of uh, all the weaknesses of a single demon, it'll show you everything about it. Cool. Don't know why I just now noticed that. Everybody in like who's watching is probably like, "This guy's an idiot." And yes, you're right. But that's okay. Oh, uh, there's problem with that. All right. Got quite a bit of Zenny. Mazio. No, no, thank you. Well, that was pretty easy. Once again, I'm over leveled. That's what I get. I just hate being under leveled, you know what I mean? Uh, where'd they go? The angels guarding the path are gone. We were unable to report to the angels. It's fine by me. Cool. Get Zama, I'm detecting the presence of a powerful. I advise that we prepare. Boss fight number two? I don't even know what, like, counts as, like, an actual boss. Because some people would count that fight I just did as, like, a, uh, a oh, you boss. I guess maybe a mini-boss? I don't know. Hey, hey, hey. Uh -huh. What's up here? What 
What is that symbol? I think that's the, the glory, I believe. The 50 glory. Yeah, it is. And I guess we get up here by doing that. Let's go, 50 glory. Can't get up there. Not yet. A couple treasures nearby. Hey, What's hey, over hey. here? Hey. Uh -huh. Who's over here? Oh. Oh, hey! It's this guy! This is the guy who I was talking about. Let's see, how many did we miss? Oh, oh, wow. Okay, we missed a lot. Never mind. I am shocked. I really thought we were really aggressive when it came to that. Well, that does not matter. That's fine. So I guess that indicates we're at the uh, near end of an area, which is cool. Oh, there's a meat man here. It's on top. How do we get in? Oh, duh. Well, what happened here? Are those slain angels? Wow. I'm detecting a demon. Oh. Bethel's reinforcements, I presume. Oh, mommy, sorry, mommy, sorry. Unfortunately, it seems your timing was a tad oh, off. Oh no! Keep your guard up, young man. I sense a dreadful power in this one. I don't like this. The angels. I like it, but I don't. This area are now dead. And I dare say they could use some company. But I'll spare you a few final moments to curse your fate. Oh. Okay, that is interesting. My name is Nua. Prepare to die. All right. This is definitely boss fight number two. No idea what you do. Um. I'm taking the safe route. These spyglass. See what's up with you. What do you got? Fire. Oh, perfect. Wait, maybe not. What else do you resist? So we can't use thunder, force, or mudo. Or dark. Okay. So I'm gonna switch out. No idea what she can do yet. All right, yeah, we're gonna use our new demon. Keeping Jack Frost. And we're definitely keeping Jack over here. I'm, I'm fine with this party. All right. I thought I read another um, Megatsumi skill at the bottom. Cool. All right, let's see what this skill looks like. Not bad. Defense 
Ghost down. All right, let's see what she can do. Thunder. Oh, okay, you're weak to that. We're fine. All right, we're pulling out all the stops. You ready? What level is she? Level 22. Okay, yeah, we are definitely over-leveled, but I think that grind was necessary. Quite a bit of damage. We probably should heal next uh, next time around. So I think on Anahita next turn we will heal on her. As long as we don't miss, we're fine. Do a damage with fire. Oh, only to one ally. All right, that's actually fine. Jack Frost needs it. Do some more damage, Jack O' Lantern. Uh oh. Oh, that did a lot. Oh no. So her specialty seems to be force. Cool cutscene though. Uh, you can use that. Jack Frost still has Recarm, which is great, and she's half health, so I think we should definitely beat this. We just have to play it smart. Oh wait, what? That's it? Okay, never mind. Interesting. Oh. I thought you'd be cleaning up the stragglers, but he looks like no angel I've seen. Yakumo. My name is Shohei Yakumo, exterminator of demons. This guy's just Rido from SMT3. He's Dollar Tree version of the. Uh... Right. Take solace in our meeting, boy. I'll make your death a painless one. Wait, do I have to fight you too? Oh, okay, yeah, we might get a game over. We have to fight this man. Come now, Yakumo. Surely you can stay your hand for a moment more. Another of your whims. Well, he stood up to me so valiantly, without a flicker of fear. Bad luck, boy. It seems fate has something more painful in mind for you. I am the goddess Nuwa, creator of the mortals and inhabitant of the <clears throat> ethereal chasm between heaven and earth. The man beside me is Yakumo. I suppose one could say he is my other half. Oh. Okay. Isn't it obvious enough? Bethel is our enemy. The god of law has warred with the other gods since time immemorial. However, the god of law gained the upper hand when he robbed the other gods of their knowledge, debasing them to their current states. Both god and his cronies in Bethel have absolute faith in the rule of law, and his armies continue to meddle in this realm to protect his order. Such zealotry cannot be permitted, Ergo, these angels were dealt with accordingly. Which is not to say those who rebel against the god of law are any better, of course. Opportunistic cretins, for the most part. 
Seeking chaos to fulfill their own selfish desires. That's why my duty is to slay both the disciples of Bethel and the ancient desecrated beings known as demons. Interesting. And this point is what finally brings me to my own question. Do you believe God's order is just? That it is necessary for this world? Hmm. If that is the case, then I ask you to think it over carefully. I suspect your opinion on the matter will carry no small weight in the end. Further within is a transportation device. The same design as the one Bethel is trying to use. Use it to return to the Tokyo you know so well. Oh. Maybe you'll see the truth. I can go back? See gods and demons alike fighting over humanity and Tokyo caught in the crossfire. <laughs> Until we meet again. Interesting. else interesting around here? Nope. Are they all turned to stone? Ah, not another one! Not this guy. Wait, wait a second. I know that face. Is that you? It's me, Ichiro Dazai. Boy, am I glad to see you're all right, man. But, uh, why do you look so different, though? Drugs. Drugs, Dazai. Whoa. Wait, so you're saying this is all because you fused with that Aogami guy? I see. Strange turn of events. Oh, hey, you're here. What? Good to see you and Dazai are fine as well. Huh? Atsuta? Yuzuru Atsuta? I was in the tunnel, same as you. It's a relief to know we all made it out okay. Now that we're reunited, I'll leave it to you to decide our next move. Y yeah, lead the way. Do you get party members? Hey! Hey! Oh, well, well, that was a big surprise, right? <laughs> hey, looks like you found who you were looking for. Well, good for you. Oh, I got. Uh, I'm not lonely or anything. I've got. Anyways, I'm gonna hang around here for a bit longer, so just. Well, I'm out of here. By the way. Mm. <laughs> Gotta hate that laugh. Oh, hey, it's that. It's the Amala device or whatever. This is Algami from the Bethel Japanese branch. Do you copy? Algami? This is the unit from way back when? I have successfully reactivated, returning to base. I don't believe it. I'm gonna have to report this, but you're clear to come through. Touching the terminal should bring you straight here. Looks like we'll be able to head back to the Tokyo we call home. Interesting. What is this? Oh, 
Oh, cool, we split. We've arrived. Is this... Are we back in Tokyo? Yes. This is Joey University's medical research lab. Of course you we know came that here is. through the Bethel terminal. That form just now. Explain yourself. Archangel Abdiel. Oh, it's you. Am I to understand you went against the condemnation? Answer, boy. Bethel will have no mercy for one who violates the will of God. Wait! Master Abdiel! Wait, what? I don't know what led to this. But he is an innocent bystander. Please forgive him. The saint. Furthermore, we both know God's laws are not so easily broken. Unbreakable, even. Then, how would you account for this? Allow the Japanese branch to look into it. Though... What I can tell you, is that this is the one they lost all those years ago. <laughs> Respectfully, Master Abdiel, I heard you were in command at the time. In which case, I would have imagined you'd be elated by the return of your subordinate, not angered by it. Very well. However, I am placing full responsibility on the Japanese branch to investigate. Man, talk about scary. What's up with her? So that's the Archangel in charge of headquarters. I was starting to worry about all of you. Nevertheless, welcome back. I think an explanation is in order. Would you mind joining me in the meeting room? Okay, terminal can be found. Terminal in the same motion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Save our game. Uh, can we fuse any new demons? I know we probably can't. Try the same stuff. Welcome to. Hey, what's new here? Oh, I didn't see that. Okay, nothing that interesting. Uh, let's check Reverse Compendium Fusion. Anything good? Right, he doesn't want to get Baphomet. He's really good. Uh, fire, I think. Never mind, plus one. Uh... We don't have Principality. What do you have? Uh, another holy user. Ooh, what do you have? I'm gonna restore gas fire rain. Interesting. We gotta summon a lot of demons. Alright, anyways, let's get back to it. Alright, let's go.
have to go this way. All right, more story stuff. Here we go. Now, where do I start? I guess I should start with me. To put it plainly, I've had spiritual powers ever since I was little. Everyone at Bethel calls me the Saint. Bethel, Japan lost a lot of its strength in a battle many years ago. So these days, even students like me are helping out. It's the same for me too. But never mind that. Interesting. Is Tokyo okay. still okay? Not long ago, we were in what looked like ruins, and they were crawling with demons. It was almost as if the city had been... If I told you the Tokyo you'd been living in this whole time was a lie, would you believe me? Mind blown. Huh? 18 years ago, something happened in the Chiyoda ward of Tokyo that suddenly erased the city from the rest of Japan. Its population of over 10 million people was wiped out in a matter of minutes, lost to the netherworld. What are you talking about, Isonokami? We've been living in Tokyo as far as I can tell. The Tokyo you're referring to is an act of God. Through his miracle, Tokyo and its people were perfectly recreated. No one suspected a thing. You mean everything up until now? It's all been fake? As I said, the real Tokyo was destroyed 18 years ago. You saw it when you slipped into the netherworld. That's impossible. The real Tokyo has been completely overrun by demons. As if one Tokyo wasn't enough, the demons now covet the other, and all for our souls. Though we are few, that is what the Bethel Japanese this guy? fights to protect. He looks like Algami. I hope the saint has cleared things up for you. Apologies for dragging you into this. Hey, uh, haven't I seen you somewhere before? My name is Koshimizu. I'm in charge here in addition to being Japan's prime minister. Bro, so what? Wait, as in Director Koshimizu? One of the top-ranking officials in the Japanese branch? He and the Prime Minister are the same person? Indeed. Glad to see you made it back in one piece, Atsuta. Now that you've been made aware of what happened to the real Tokyo, it's best I enlighten you as to the true state of the world. To put it plainly, the forces of order and chaos are currently clashing behind the scenes, locked in an ongoing battle unbeknownst to mankind. Demons seek human souls. If given the chance, they would flood the real world in an instant. They are extremely dangerous. That's why Bethel Japan is dedicated to protecting Tokyo and keeping the demons at bay. The demons are relentless, however. And the unfortunate truth of the matter is that we're woefully lacking in manpower. In fact, Bethel's strength is so short of the mark, we've been forced to rely on students such as Isonokami and Atsuta for help. No way! Is that something I could help with too, Mr. Prime Minister? You mean protecting Tokyo? I yeah! Does that- Look, I'm borderline useless at school, and I'm always making trouble for other people. But even a guy like me wants to be someone people can turn to. Just like the honor students. Uh, I don't know about that, Chief. Thank you. I admire your courage. I've heard about you. So you fused with Algami, is that it? I'll be asking for your cooperation as well. Sorry, but I won't take no for what an answer. What the hell is Algami? He looks exactly like you. Good to see you're on our side. I'm thankful the Proto Fiend returned safely, though I've never heard of it fusing with a human before. I played a role in Algami's creation myself. I'll be running a variety of tests later. Algami, I'd like to examine your memory data. Make your way to the research facility later today. Understood. I'll visit with the rest of you some other time. For now, I want you to go home and get some rest. Sir! And lastly, 
Yuzuru Atsuta. Well done in coming back unharmed. Your summoning skills must have improved. I'll be sure to grant you an even stronger demon companion next time. What? Lucky. Thank you, sir. Do we still run like we got shit in our pants? Yeah, oh yeah, we do. Dude, I am gonna be fighting alongside all those big names at school. Me? A big reason I don't do all that well in school is because, honestly, I'm just not very confident in myself. Well, neither am I, and I'm doing fine. Even though my parents aren't divorced, they really don't get along. So, I guess I've always just been looking for a way, but if I side with my dad, my mom gets all pissed. And it's the same for my old man if I ever side with my mom. I don't know what's right anymore. Protecting Tokyo from demons, though? That's gotta be a good thing. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I'm glad we're both alright. Let's work together to keep Tokyo safe. Right. All right, well, what if I want to go back? I should apologize for hiding the fact that I was involved with Bethel. I didn't want to get you involved, but I also didn't think the situation would become as dire as it is now. We should probably head back. We've got school tomorrow. Bro, I still have to go back to school, bruh. All right, well, I think I'm going to end the episode here. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. A lot happened this episode. So uh, we definitely went over the 20-minute mark and the 30-minute mark as well. So uh, thank you all so much for watching. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.